So I'm assuming they're gonna attack me via stomping. We could go poke them. Do we want to go poke them? See what they're all about? I don't know about that. Let's go poke them. Do you aggro? Oh yeah, you aggro. They're just hard to hit, but we can kill them. Three hits and we kill them. How many of them are there? There's a lot. We could probably run past a couple of them. Oh Lord, there's even more down there. Oh my God. Okay, so this is gonna be a process once more. Take our time, be observant, see if we find any items. I know there's one over here. Okay. I see two more items in front of me. We obviously want to go to that building. And hopefully we'll end up on this bridge above us. It's a big door. Hmm. Huh. I don't really have to fight them, it seems. Which, I'm okay with that. Yeah, if I don't have to, let's not engage. They're not hard to kill, but they're just really hard to hit. Okay. These things. Are you alive? No, but you move. The statues move even if they're not, like, activated. Man, I feel... I feel surrounded. <laughs> I don't like it here. Okay. So these things are definitely in our way. It looks like there's a tree branch there. You guys get ah. Oh. Okay, we're safe in the building. Okay, are you a mimic? Trust nothing. Okay. Soul of a great hero. Mm. Mm. Guess there's nothing else here. Let's go this way so we don't um, get in aggro range. What are these things called? Do we want to call them dino tail? Lava dino tailers? Di dino tailers? Dino tailers. They work on all the finest clothes of the great Jurassic period. Okay, there's an item over there I saw. That's a heck of a walk, though. Huh. Do 
to win humanities. Nice. Okay. So anything else? So just a big pile of lava over there. Um, more of the dino tailors. And there are two items over there. Which is going to be a walk. Okay, I want to go over there. Um, I don't see any other items. So let's go back down here and head that way. We got plenty of flask on us. Let's try not to aggro that thing if we can avoid it. Divine Blessing? Divine Blessing. Run! Being impatient. Calm down. Okay. Good deal. Okay. I don't see any other items. Take our time. Explore. Be observant. Look out in the distance for anything white and glowing. Okay. Pay attention. Him, no worries. Ah, nice. Light the bonfire and let's rest. Okay. I'm not going to kindle this one because we still got plenty of flask on us for now. It looks like we can go over there. I don't see anything past them. I don't see any way for us to get past the, the tree. So that seems to be the end of the map. So let's run this way. Okay. It's cool to think that this is like a tree's roots, but it's growing in lava. Like that. That's just cool. And it has like this like charcoal kind of look to it. So we can't go here. Can we swing that? No. Um, I think there's a way for us to drop down here. Would there be an item here? We Looks like we'd have to go back into the lava. Let's go take a look. Let's be adventurous. Hmm. Appears that this was indeed a waste. That's alright. Okay. So we fought a caterpillar demon, um, a big, short wing, fat dinosaur fire, like just like with the, the imp dragon hammer guy that we fought in the very, very beginning. Um... 
And that's pretty much all I fought here so far for like named bosses. Big Butt Demon. Is that what they're called? Is Big Butt Demon? I like that name. It's a fitting name. Azo Tech, welcome! How's it going, bud? Dark Souls 2 has a butthole face demon. Really? Hmm. Hmm. The Great Journey. <laughs> How's your Friday, Azo Tech? Time. See, that looks like that would be a hidden wall, but it's not. You play League every morning, really nice. How long have you been playing it? Since the very, very beginning, or two, four, six years? League's been around for a long time. AKA LOL. Four years, nice. Very nice. When you love it. Alright, so there's an item over here. Huh, we must have to go up there and then come back and drop down. I thought about getting into League a long, long time ago. I know one buddy of mine wanted me to play. Um, but I only played it once or twice. I played a lot of Smite though, but I know it's two different things. When you love it, you love it. That's true. It's very, very true. What's your favorite position? Do you like, uh, 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 favorite lane? Do you juggle? I know some of the terms, but not, not everything. Like, I don't, I don't know any of the hero names. When you go to uni, you're gonna uh, you're gonna get World of Warcraft and play that. Nice potion, very nice. Got into support. Yeah, um, one of my buddy's friends was big into support. Uh, when I first played, he joined in to help me. He helped me a lot. But I, I've, I think it was like two or three days, like one weekend. But it, it was fun. It was definitely different. Just games like that, though, you, like... I've learned from playing like some Overwatch and playing Call of Duty and playing uh, Smite. You gotta have a team. If you don't have a, a decent, like at least one or two other teammates that are with you all the time, it's really, really hard to um, to do anything. From my experience, I never practiced enough to be able to like, uh oh. Okay, so we are being invaded. Great. Also, what the hell is that? You're going to pay for it using your uni loan. Really, Boshin? Hmm. Okay. You're going to sell it? Well, War of Warcraft really isn't the same as, like, Overwatch. Those are very two different animals. War of Warcraft is all about getting items and raids. Stuff like that. You might need help with bosses, but that's it.
Dark Souls is growing on you. Yeah, Dark Souls, this game feels great. I love it. I um I thought that I was gonna be able to mix this and Fallout 2 together, but I'm just like I'm 100% like just I've got to play this until I beat it. Now I'm fully plugged in, committed. It's it was said. I can't. I love. I'm. I I get the feel for it. It feels good. All right, let's deal with this a hole. <laughs> All right, we commence. Ooh. No! Oh, you can't flash, man. GG. Yeah, he got it. He even did, like, the honorable thing. But that was a completely acceptable death. I like that. That was okay. That was my own... That was my own fault. I'm okay with that. That was cool. I like him. You didn't pay attention to it, but it, it looks well worth trying. Yeah, it definitely is. I recommend, um... Um, well, this is the remastered version, which I think it's, it's, I got it when it was 40, or I think it's 40, but I never got to play the original, but it's nice. I love it. But the, I think the, the remastered comes already with, uh, any DLC, um, is what I've been told. So, um, that's a nice perk of getting the, the remastered. And of course, this is also, um, there's Dark Souls 2 and 3, of course, which I'm sure you already knew that. And then also, um, Bloodborne is associated with this. It's the same company. What's up, Jake Guardy? That intro. How's your day, bud? Happy Friday. I just died in PvP, but I died in like a real honorable way that I'm really happy about. Oh god. Okay. Let's not let's not do this. Let's not do this. Also, Azotech, the thing about this game, um that's really interesting is that you cannot be greedy. Like this game, if you try to like rush something or not play every move very strategically, um, it bites you in the butt. It comes for you no, at any point. An enemy you think, oh, not a problem, they're easy. It comes for you. My day, my day's going pretty good. Pretty good. Can't complain. We've already killed two bosses. Two or no, we killed. We killed the crystal dragon. We killed a demon centipede. Uh. Fire fat butt demon and I think that's it. Also we got a lava ring so we can walk around lava. We still take damage, but it's real slow. I don't know why he was breathing random fire on the tree. Who are you attacking?
Hmm. And then at this point is when I had gotten invaded. Okay. Make sure I keep my bearings. Oh, yeah, we already got this item. Okay, okay. I know exactly where I'm at. Because when I got that item is when I had gotten invaded. Okay. Alright, now let's go deal with whatever this this gold mushroom... This is like trumpets or something he's holding in his hand. Bad guy? Yeah, don't, don't sneak up behind me. You see why they made sequels? Yeah. Well, eventually we'll be playing 2 and 3. Uh, 2 has got the most controversy because it was... I think if I remember correctly, people said it was made by a different person or a different company or in... Anyway, like that. I'll learn more about that before I speak about that. But 2's um, got a little controversy. But, uh, but yeah, we'll be playing them eventually. I'm bouncing between this and Fallout. Um... Which is nice. Same company, different director. Okay, thank you, Wazi Chosen. There we go. Thank you, thank you. And, um, I don't have Bloodborne, but I want to play Bloodborne. But that's a PS4 exclusive. Now, Bloodborne, um, from what I've seen and what I've heard people talk about, is a more Victorian Gothic, really interesting look to it. Oh my god, that sound. Oh, those are eyes! Oh, what fresh hell are you? Oh, it's a big teeth! Okay. Thank God they're not, not, thank God it's not that tough. Now, why is it chosen? Have you played Blood Bloodborne? Or has anyone here played Bloodborne? Super ugly and super weak enemy. Yeah, definitely ugly. You ain't kidding about ugly. I don't even know if his mama loves him after that. That is not a matter of ugly. You've seen bits, but never played it. Okay. There's also still Demon Souls as well. I'm really interested in that. And was it chosen? You said that Demon Souls is technically the very, very first installment of any game like this. Now, was that made by the same director of this or company, or were they just inspired by Demon Souls? Same company. Okay. No, no, no. Oh! Ah! We need that item. We need that item. <sighs> it's got a very Mayan... Now, actually, this looks like, um... This temple looks more like the temples you see, I think it's Thailand and Vietnam. Those real old ancient temples. They've got the same type of like pillars on the top. Definitely of, um, definitely uh, design inspired from like the, the Asian continent, not Central America. Can we, um, can we finagle this? Okay, there we go. Rare Ring of Sacrifice. I've got three of them now. I guess that's really good to put on if I'm unsure about a boss, but... I mean, if I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. Oh, 
Although there has been a couple times where I wish I would have had that ring. Secrets, no items. Take our time. Be observant. Like, are we, like, inside of a tree that's a tree of lava? Or... I don't know, but this camera panning right now. Look at the light. Yeah! Ah, oh, I love it! God, I love this game! I understand so much now why people love this game. I understand. Okay, so there's a way to go up and there's a way to go down. Okay. Let's murder you. Something behind the tree. Oh boy. Oh boy. Nothing underneath there. Okay, another one of those ugly enemies are up there. Where does this go? <gasps> oh, shit. Well, so much for exploring up there! Oh no. <laughs> I broke the floor, I'm sorry. I hear, oh. Oh, God. Again, I know, right? Again. <laughs> There's a lot of these ugly enemies here. I am not a fan. And there's no way to go back up? Surely there's got to be a way to go back up. Probably through a boss, though. Are you? Can, you, can I aggro you? Can you come down? Come on down, you ugly thing. Don't go all cross-eyed on me. Come on. Come on down. Huh. Can't go up that way. There's nothing hidden behind there. There's no point in dropping down there. So this circles back. Can we make that jump? That seems like a an implausible jump. I don't see if any other way to get there though, so maybe maybe it is. Wow, that seems like really tight. <laughs> 